Trucker here. Welcome to my channel. I hope you enjoy it. Got the Boston Trucker with you. It's a beautiful Sunday morning at 6 a.m. The only reason I get up that early on a Sunday is going to a truck show. Heading to the 19th annual Bay State Chapter Antique Truck Show. It's not an antique, but it is 2007, and they take the old trucks and new trucks there. So uh, we're going to head over there. We're going to meet a few guys, convoy to the truck show, and uh, see what's up. Let's go. I was on my way to the truck show, and I got a call from Dean Croak in the Grumpy Pete. Said he's about two minutes behind me, so I'll pull over and wait for him. I told him to do a drive-by, I'll get a little video. What year is the tractor? It's a 1991. Really? Wow. Uh, it's like 30 years old. Yeah, it's one of the original CHs that EMF bought. Mm. Very nice. I use it right up the end. And did you do LTL most of your life in freight? Uh, no, I did uh, when I was in St. John's I did uh, mostly uh, line haul. Line haul, yep. And I started out in line haul in New England and I went into the city as I got older. You know? Yeah. So when you were running line haul, where were you normally running? Down in the city or up north? I was running a lot of Pittsburgh. I, I did Pittsburgh, Pittsburgh for okay. Pittsburgh years, yeah. Both so you, for New England and St. John's. Right? So you run out there and get a, and get a hotel and then come yeah. back? Yeah, they would put us up and then send us back the next night. You know? Wow. So uh, I enjoyed it, but as I got older, I wanted to sleep in my own bed at night. You know? Sure. So, How long have you been driving trucks? I uh, started in 1974, so. How you doing? How are you guys? There he is. How are you guys? How are you, Mike? Good. Show, hell of a show you guys got here today. Well, we're doing pretty good today. Nice turn out. Thanks for coming. Absolutely. You have here.
Can you tell me about this truck? This one? Yeah. It's a 1965 B61 SX. It's got a 673C engine in it, which is turbocharged. With, back then, put out 250 horsepower. Wow. It's an 18 speed. 18 um, speed? 18 speed. It's a triple frame. It's got 58 rears in it. Um, it's a nice truck. It's a nice truck. Can I check out the interior? You sure can. 18 speed. 18 no speed. That is, like, do you wax the dashboard? Like it's all, yeah, we, it's all, yeah, we do. It's all metal. There's no, yeah. there's no plastic in this truck. No plastic in this truck. And the, uh, who does all the polishing on this truck? That's, that's Me and my son. Really? Yeah. And this guy over here, my other son. How you doing? Good to self. I'm yeah. doing well. Side. 73 years old and uh, still going at it. I'm driving a front end loader right now, but okay. no more trucking. I'm done trucking. What's the best kind of truck there is? You think, you think Mac is the oh, best? Oh, I love Max. I love Max. What do you love about Max so much? Um, I was brought up with them, and um, you know, a lot of people don't like them, but I, I love Max. And it's uh, Max are kind of in the in the. Uh, in the back row yeah. now, but, but I still love Max, you know. That's great, and this is your son, yeah, Michael Safari, and that's your son, yeah. and that's your grandfather. Yeah. Yeah. The three generations of truckers right here. Yeah. Yep. What's your favorite kind of truck? The one that doesn't break down. Okay, good answer. What about <laughs> yours? <laughs> no, Western Star. Yeah, you like the Western Star? Yeah, that's what I get now. Star. Uh, you know, I like the Western Stars, I like the Max, I like the Kenworth, I, I like them all, really. You know. Very cool. What'd you bring? What'd you bring to the show today? I brought a 1988 uh, Mack 10 wheeler that uh, Tommy McIntyre bought, brand new. Yeah. And uh, and uh, it, uh, it's a, been a good truck. Okay. Been a Right here. Thank you. Oh my God. Oh, you know this guy? Oh. The, 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 the uh, Boston trucker. You ever see his videos? Oh, oh. Standing here with Teray Foster. How you doing today, my friend? I'm doing good. How you doing? I'm doing good. What brings you to the Bay State Chapter Truck Show here? Oh, we're just out enjoying uh, all the old antique trucks and brought the uh, bus out. Thought some people might want to check out an old Bluebird bus. That is pretty cool. I, I was admiring it earlier. What, uh, what can you tell me about your bus? Oh, it's a 1987 Bluebird Wander Lodge. And uh, Wander Lodge, was a, it's a motor coach. It was always built as a RV, but it was manufactured by uh, Bluebird. Really? Yeah. yeah. And what do you do with this thing? Uh, this is a, uh, it's just a, a, a toy. It's an RV. Or yeah. You take, go, go, go camping with the wife and really? try to enjoy life after, uh, working hard in construction all week long. Yeah. Is that what you do for a living? Yeah. yeah. You operate, drive? Uh, I have a small construction company. We, we do excavating, we do landscape construction and we do some trucking. 
Yeah. So has uh, you for hire? Uh, we are for hire, how, yes. So how somebody contact you if they want to hire you? Uh, NewEnglandEnterprises.com in Marlboro is probably the best one. do something I normally do not do in my truck show videos only because I forget I'm actually gonna get my truck on video at the show because every time I get home I realize I didn't get any pictures or any videos of my truck so now I can say at least my truck was here considering the weather we had over the last week Looks pretty damn good. And Andrew did a fantastic job with his truck too. I just want to say that I'm proud of him. You know, he doesn't have a lot of truck shows under his belt, but he got the old bulldog shined up. He got his frame looking good. Old Brockway there, look at that. He got his frame looking good. Get mine looking good. I think we represented pretty well. That's all I'm going to say about that. looking at Jack BC. Jack BC had a just like this only I think it had a cat in it um, but a lot of them had a, a V8 Detroit some some of them had V10 Detroits really and oh yeah scream <laughs> and BC went to work for Ronnie Sincata and he was gonna sell the truck and we went and looked at the time I was doing the trailer moves and we went and looked at it I couldn't fit behind the wheel, <laughs> <laughs> and so that kind of that kind of cooled it off right there. Right, right. But they are cool. So they are cool looking trucks. Though. Absolutely, cool. A lot of, a lot of little details on this. Yeah. Look at the pipes coming yeah. out of there. Yeah, they did a nice job. Okay. But see, this truck's made to be run. Yeah, you guys did a good job.
Got back from the truck show. Good time. A lot of awesome people. It's all about the people, really. To me, the trucks are just a bonus. Meeting everybody. People come up to me saying hello, saying they recognize me from YouTube and social media. That's pretty awesome. You know, my head won't get too big, but that—that that is why I wear an expandable hat, just in case it does. But no, that will never happen. Uh, yeah, people make the show. That's what it's about. Awesome trucks. Get some good video footage, I hope. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next video at the next truck show. Hit that subscribe button. Tell your friends, share the videos. Peace and grease. Boston Trucker out. See ya.